Hello everyone, and welcome to our comprehensive tutorial on Pharmanaut's web app for satellite-based farm monitoring. Whether you're a seasoned farmer or just starting out, this platform is designed to make crop and field management easier, smarter, and more efficient. Once you've added a field to the system, it will appear on your main dashboard. This dashboard serves as your central hub for monitoring all your fields. To access a specific field, simply click the My Fields button at the top of the screen. A drop-down menu will appear, allowing you to select any field and dive into its detailed data, such as crop health, irrigation status, and more. To make things intuitive, we've included an analysis scale that's easy to understand, even for those with minimal technical knowledge. For example, green indicates healthy crops with no immediate concerns. Orange suggests moderate health, where some attention might be needed. Dark red flags a potential serious issue in specific areas of your field, prompting closer inspection. This color-coded system ensures you can quickly assess your field status at a glance. Let's walk through how to add a new field to the platform. Start by clicking the Add New Field button, which opens an interactive map interface. This feature is designed to be flexible, offering multiple ways to locate your farm. Search using a physical address for quick navigation, enter precise latitude and longitude coordinates for accuracy, or upload a KML or shapefile if you have pre-existing boundary data. Once your farm is located on the map, you can begin mapping the field by clicking along its boundaries to create a polygon. If your field is circular, common for pivot irrigation systems, select the Draw Circular Field option and adjust the circle to match your field shape. After mapping, click the Submit for Pre-Processing button. A dialog box will pop up, prompting you to enter essential details, including crop name, specify what you're growing, like wheat or maize, description, add any relevant notes about the field, sowing date, this helps the system tailor its analysis to your crop's growth stage. All these fields are mandatory to ensure accurate monitoring. Once submitted, if you don't have an active subscription, you'll be directed to the payment page. Here, you can choose a plan that fits your needs. Depending on your region, you'll be guided through either the Razor Pay or Stripe Payment Gateway. Enter your mobile number, complete the payment, and upon success, you'll return to the dashboard where your newly added field will be listed alongside others. To explore a specific field, click on Field Details from the dashboard. This section allows you to view and edit information such as crop type or sowing date and save any updates to keep your data current. You can also access your profile by clicking the profile icon in the top bar. Here you'll find details like your active subscription plans and user information giving you full control over your account settings. One of the core features of Farmonaut is the NDVI, the Normalized Difference Vegetation Index, a powerful tool for monitoring crop health. NDVI highlights areas of strong growth and pinpoints regions under stress, helping you make informed decisions. The top section of the Field Details screen displays the satellite visit date showing when the data was captured, the field area, measured in hectares or acres, the field name for easy identification. By clicking on the dates, you can browse all available satellite observation days and select one to view its specific analysis. Clicking the NDVI button reveals other major indices such as hybrid index. Our hybrid index simplifies monitoring by combining crop health and irrigation data into a single, easy to read map. The color codes are green indicates healthy crops and adequate irrigation, Orange signals that crop health may need attention. Purple suggests irrigation issues. Red highlights areas where both health and irrigation are problematic or indicates no crop or cloud cover. White represents cloud cover during satellite observation, obscuring data. Index usage by growth stage. Different indices suit different crop stages. NDVI is ideal for early growth or sparse canopy crops like young wheat, NDRE is better for later stages or dense canopy crops such as soybeans or maize. Irrigation monitoring. We use three key parameters to assess irrigation. NDWI, 
detects areas with low water content in plants or soil. Evapotranspiration measures water loss from plants in soil, critical for water management. And NDMI reflects soil moisture levels, helping you optimize irrigation schedules. Together, these provide a comprehensive view of your field's water status. Soil Health, SOC, Soil Organic Carbon. The SOC index is valuable before sowing and after harvesting. Instead of taking random soil samples, use SOC data to target areas with low organic carbon, which often correlates with nutrient deficiencies, saving you time and effort. Digital Elevation Model, DEM, shows your field's terrain elevation, high, medium, or low-lying areas. This is crucial for identifying spots prone to water logging, allowing you to level land or plan drainage solutions proactively. Radar Data, SAR, when clouds block traditional satellite data, our system switches to microwave radar, SAR, data, ensuring continuous monitoring. We provide RVI, radar vegetation index for crop health, and RSM, radar soil moisture for irrigation insights. This ensures reliable data even during rainy or cloudy conditions. Reports. Every three to five days, depending on your location, a satellite captures your field and a detailed report is generated within 24 hours. If you're subscribed to WhatsApp notifications, you'll receive these reports directly. Alternatively, access them via the web dashboard, mobile app, or email. Each report includes a downloadable PDF, language options for accessibility, and a field map divided into nine directional zones to help you locate problem areas easily. The report's later pages provide scientific insights and detailed parameter analysis for deeper understanding. Historical data and comparison. Using the Map Control button, you can request historical data dating back to 2017, generate time-lapse animations to visualize changes, and compare two indices side-by-side -side for in-depth analysis. Index results. The Index Results section offers time series graphs showing how indices like NDVI or NDMI change over days or months. This helps you spot trends and make data-driven decisions. Weather Forecast Stay prepared with hourly forecasts for the next two days, daily forecasts for up to eight days. To return to the main dashboard from any section, simply click the Home button. In the Show All Farms section, you can view details like farm ID, username, and description, total area and subscription duration, date added and status, active, expiring, or expired. You can also search for specific farms, check the status of active or expired fields, or restore deleted fields by selecting the Deleted filter and clicking the Restore button. This concludes our overview of Farmonaut's web app for satellite monitoring. We've designed this platform to make remote farm management accurate, user-friendly, and accessible to farmers worldwide. For more information, visit our website or contact our support team. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to helping you optimize your farming with Farmonaut.